I'm a flow motion photographer. It's kind of a style of filmmaking I've worked out where the camera takes on a, the role of a character and zooms and explores through a destination. There's a mixture of techniques. I mean, I guess the go-to discipline I have is time-lapse and variations of that are, are hyperlapse and interesting zooms. So the story is essentially a journey where we join a character and follow them journeying through something of a mystery walk through Tokyo and see where she ends up. A lovely thing about this new system is it has that perfect mix of smaller form factor that you get from the mirrorless system but also has the handling characteristics that uh, you get with the, the larger DSLR bodies and there doesn't seem to be any compromise there. So in particular the ISO button now is on the right hand side of the camera right next to the shutter button so with one hand you can change ISO during shooting with the gimbal which is very handy. As a photographer, you attach great importance to lenses and choice of lenses and it's a, it's a long process getting to know a lens and getting to know how to get the most out of it. So being able to use the vast variety of F-mount lenses on this new system is imperative. And then the exciting part is what the new Z lenses will bring. My work is all about the synergy between shooting and post-production and it's about utilising new technology and new cameras and seeing and exploring what they can do both in camera and then in the post-production through pushing the raw files and through achieving you know, impossible zooms. My initial impressions are you know, image quality seems very good, very sharp throughout from the corners to the centre. You know, you come to expect such quality from Nikon and, and yeah, it certainly is impressive. With regards to the new Nikon Z7, the image quality is always a draw. You can do a lot of the camera work in post, and that allows you to connect scenes and do impossible camera moves, you know, things that have never been done before. So that's what excites me.